Hi friends, Brie Firth here, and today I'm making a Starry Night slimline card featuring the effects stickers from Chibitronics and the stamp set Hello Friends from Scrappy Boy Stamps. And I'm using the cute little girl stamped image and the little star outline die to uh, create the Starry Night Sky and build a little scene. And I'm also using the effects stickers from Chibitronics and they make four little effects. There's a fade, there's a blink, heartbeat, and twinkle. And I'm using the twinkle, twinkle effect sticker uh, for this card. So I already went ahead and I pre-traced my circuit with a pencil onto a card backing. Um, in the center there, there's the effect sticker and it's attached to the three uh, sticker lights. I'm putting yellow sticker lights there. And if you need more information on how to use the effect sticker, I'm going to provide a link in the description below. Uh, basically, it's going to connect, you can have it connect to a single track of lights, but I chose to connect it, have two lights on the negative side and two lights on the positive side, or one light on the positive side of the sensor sticker, uh, so that it have kind of an alternating effect. And like I said, there's a lot more information um, in the link that I uh, included in the description below. So now I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to run my copper tape along uh, the track that I already built uh, with the pencil. I'm going to connect the battery holder to where the, scent, uh, the effect sticker is going to be located. And I'm just going to press that into the paper with my scoring tool. And then I'm going to run this little piece of copper tape right up the center between the the star uh, the stars and the light placement. Having a little trouble getting the fold. It's a little tricky, but once you get a hang of it, then it'll go nice and smooth. Like I said, the um, two of the stars are connected on the positive side of the sensor sticker, and then one is connected onto of the negative of the top, but it's the vice versa when you're talking from the bottom. It's kind of a little confusing, but when you see it in action, I think it'll make sense. And once the circuit's all pre-built, it'll also look a lot more, a lot easier to understand. So now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to place the twinkle effect sticker before I finish running the rest of the circuit to the lights. And you want to make sure that it's in the right direction. Now you also use the stencil that's included in the effects sticker pack to help create uh, the circuit layout. I really like using that stencil for for all of my uh, Chibitronics light up cards. And I'm just finishing uh, connecting the sensor the effects sensor to my where the sticker lights are going to be. I just have to run it up this last side. Sorry, the card base is a little bit bigger since it's a slim line. It's a three and a half by eight and a half, so it's kind of hard to get it all on camera. I'm going to use my scoring tool one more time to smooth out that copper tape. And there's the full circuit. So now I'm going to go ahead and place my LED sticker lights. And I'm going to use the yellow lights. But first I'm going to go ahead and add some conductive fabric patches uh, right over. I'm going to do it right over the top of the sensor. And I'm going to do it right over the little short pieces in the center. Um, that I cut separately. I just want to make sure that I get a nice uh, connect conductive circuit. So 
So now I'm going to go ahead and use my sticker lights. I'm using the yellow, which has the positive and negative side. So make sure that you're placing the sticker light in the correct direction. And I'm just using the yellow lights, but the pack comes in yellow, reds, and blues. Or you can get the sampler pack that has all of the colors. And I have the uh, sampler pack listed in the description below as well. So now our circuit is built, and I'm going to take a coin battery to uh, place it into the battery holder, and then, as you can see, our circuit works. And now I'm going to take some foam tape, I'm going to put it all around the outside of our circuit to account for the height of the battery. So I went ahead and already did that, and I peeled off the backing paper, but I made sure not to put foam tape over and top the star outline. And I used the cute little star stamp from the same stamp set, and I stamped it in black pigment ink onto vellum so that the cute little stars will shine through our, our night sky background. Now I'm going ahead and adding some liquid adhesive all around um, on the back side of our card front. And then I'm going to glue the vellum onto the back side of that. And then I'm going to press that down onto our card base circuit. And now that that's built, I'm going to slide my little coin battery inside, making sure it's the right set, positive side up. And as you can see, our stars are twinkling, so that means our circuit is still working. So now I'm going to finish building the rest of the card front. And I used Seedless Preserves, Blueprint Sketch, Chip Sapphire, and Black Soot Distress Oxide inks to create the night sky background. And I also used some white acrylic paint to create the, the kind of splatter effect. And to create the little grassy borders, I used the grassy borders die set from Lawn Fawn. And I used mossy, sorry, <laughs> mowed lawn and uh, rustic wilderness distress inks to add a little bit of shading to my grassy die cuts. And... I'm going to go ahead and place these little characters that I already colored up and I already put some foam tape onto the back of them so I'm just going to peel the backing paper off and then stick them into the little grass. And the teddy bear is from the Hello Everyone stamp set which is part of the Hello Everyone collection which is where the Hello Friends set is also from uh, which I'll also link in the description below. I just thought she looked really cute with the little teddy bear sitting in a field looking at the stars. So now I'm going to go ahead and add my sentiment, which is which says reach for the stars that I heat embossed in gold embossing powder onto blue cardstock. And it coordinates perfectly with our night sky. And for some last final touches onto the card front, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add some sequins for embellishment. But I just wanted you to see the twinkling stars once again with our scene kind of all built. Now I'm just going to go ahead and add the card base, which is cut from, it's a 7 inches by 8.5 inches and it's scored at the 3.5 inch mark on the 7 inch side. So when folded, it's three and a half by eight and a half. And I'm just gonna use some liquid adhesive to attach that to our card base. And our card is finished. And there you go. Some twinkling lights created with the effects stickers from Chibitronics, as well as the 
yellow LED sticker lights and the Hello Friends stamp set from Scrappy Boy Stamps. Hope you enjoy. Check back soon for more creations.